Hello YouTubers, your scripter speaking. I'm going to talk to you about crypto exchanger. Crypto exchanger, you know the history of crypto exchanger. I don't know if you are familiar with it, but I'm going to give you a short uh, history lesson on this um, ICO. ICO began nearly two months ago, two and a half months ago, and they had a really promising uh, platform. The, it was a lending platform. You could have um, uh, hype in it, that is high yield investment uh, programs. So uh, um, uh, from 3% to 5% per day. And uh, they had this exchange. So you can change one uh, cryptocurrency to the other one. So it was really promising, they, were, they had so many options. At some moment they said, okay, sorry, we are not going to have uh, our lending platform. Because they come to this conclusion that if we are going to be sustainable, then we have to get rid of this lending platform because it's not sustainable we want to be we want to we are a company we are going to be sustainable so we are not going to do the lending and the hype was also uh, scrapped from their platform because they said we cannot no company can pay three to, to five percent every day so they said we are going to get it up that one as well when they did that the price in the beginning, really, we had really difficulty getting to the ICO. Uh, began with 80 cents, I think, until uh, the last round was $3. But nobody wanted to have it because it was a known lending platform anyway. But something good about them that they had a working exchange. And if I go to the uh, here, uh, exchange cryptocurrency at the best rate okay you see they have different coins and they can change it to different ones now for example 100 i want to add btc and it's going to be really quickly why did they uh, do the ico actually you may ask they did ico because at this moment, they get your NAV in this example. They go to the third party exchange and they get BTC and give it to you. But they wanted to have this the platform in uh, such a way that they didn't have to go to the third party in order to change the, uh, to, to the other currency. So they wanted to do it in house. So what they did, they wanted to have ICO and then get the money and then have their own um, blockchain in order to change from one cryptocurrency to the other cryptocurrency. As I said, the last round was really uh, when they announced that there is, this is not going to be a lending platform, then nobody wanted to buy. And I think the last round wasn't finished. So they decided to just um, give some tokens, the extra tokens which they couldn't sell. They wanted to give as a appreciation of the people who have taken part in this in the ICO. So they have different uh, airdrops in January 27, I think, or 29th of January. Just let's go and have a look at the Telegram channel. They have, I think when it is, airdrop. Okay, airdrop is, starts and end, end of this, uh, the upcoming event got, got up. Okay, when is it? I think it is on end of January. Here. 
they are going to have a snapshot of the wallet or if you you can you can uh, put your tokens in a wallet in the crypto exchange wallet and they're going to a snapshot of the blockchain and to see how ma how many uh, tokens you have then you're going to get percentage of these um, uh, tokens the one they have uh, extra this is the first in the end of january is the first airdrop and in february is the second airdrop for the people who have kept their tokens okay they have uh, as i said the last round was nearly three dollars per token and they have gone to an uh, exchange very not very known exchange is a chinese exchange that is uh, top btc com uh, dot com and you can if you are interested you can buy you can buy the tokens there and then uh, bring it to the platform and take part in the airdrop uh, if you want to do that okay i put a link here to the platform so you can uh, subscribe to the, this, this uh, platform and then transfer your tokens from uh, bit topbit.com to your uh, crypto exchanger platform and then you have to do it by 29th of january otherwise you are not be able to take part in a drop uh, airdrop and uh, above that you have to do certain things if you want to take part in the airdrop you have to share some uh, uh, some information about crypto exchanger on their um, just let me see um, you have to share on the me on the social media twitter um, telegram and facebook one of them and then you have to fill in the application form so you can you all be eligible to get this airdrop uh, if i go to this let's say where it is okay let me see blockchain okay let's go to they had the website for airdrop airdrop where is airdrop let's see if i can find it Telegram. Oh yeah, here. It is on their program, but there is a website airdrop. You can go there, and this information is to be found there as well. Airdrop registration will start on twentieth of January at nine a.m. and the snapshot will be taken on twenty ninth of January at twelve p.m. UTC. We have allocated 1 million uh, EXCC coin for the airdrop and they can be found at, okay, they have already mined this, they wanted to sell it on the ICO but it didn't uh, happen because there was not so many animo for these tokens, the people didn't want to have it, so now they have the airdrop. Uh, the first of the first of uh, first of airdrops is going to be in January in end of January and the other one in February okay and there are some conditions you have to at, have at least 50 uh, ECEX CC coins in your desktop wallet or crypto exchanger wallet and then holding uh, others holding at, in their desktop wallet or web wallet Oh yeah, if you are from ICO, if you have ICO, then uh, you have to have 50, uh, at least 50 EXCC on your desktop wallet or your crypto exchange wallet. But if you are buying it from exchange, then you have to have at least 200 at the time of snapshot. Well, where you can buy it? 
you go to top top bit uh, top BTC and when you go there I just put a link uh, so you can go there you can buy it at this moment it is really cheap even cheaper than their ICO price let's see how much it is and let's see the last price the lowest la latest let's see how much it is copy I'm going to put it here oh yes take me okay one two three four two eight three six it is 33 cent people 33 cent it was three dollar at the last round of ICO so you know this is going to be really great and it's going to be really big one it is ICO it is not a scam it, they, they have gone to ICO they have gone to exchange and they have done things and they are, you are going to get also some um, some tokens as well okay so you can go to this one I put a link for uh, uh, for this exchange under this video and also I put a link for getting to crypto exchanger platform also here under and then you can uh, see if you can if you will if you want to get to this ICO to this um, get these tokens and take part in the airdrop okay if you have any question any remark about this uh, ICO this this um, uh, crypto exchanger let me know down on the uh, comments and subscribe subscribe and hit the notification bell anytime I have new information you will be the first one to hear about it okay signing off talking to you in the next video sayonara